Do you like cats? Cats are one of the most adorable animal in the world now. Many people have hobby to observe cat. Because cats are very friendly and not harmful for the kids. Cats are also good friend to adult people and they always do funny things. So, if you are a cat lover, this video is for you. Here we talk to you about 15 most cutest cats breed in the world. Number 1. Munchkin. The munchkin, also known as sausage cat, is a breed of cat characterized by its very short legs, which are caused by genetic mutation. Compared to many other cat breeds, it is a relatively new breed, documented since 1940s and officially recognized in 1991. The munchkin is considered to be the original breed of dwarf cat. Much controversy erupted over the breed when it was recognized by the International Cat Association, TICA, in 1997 with critics voicing concerns over potential health and mobility issues. Many pedigree cat associations around the world have refused to recognize the munchkin cat due to the welfare of the breed and severity of the health issues, including the governing council of the cat fancy. The name Munchkin derives from writer L. Frank Baum's diminutive inhabitants of Munchkin Country, originating in the 1900 novel, The Wonderful Wizard of Oz. Number 2. Ragdoll Cat The ragdoll is a breed of cat with a distinct color point coat and blue eyes. Its morphology, morphology is large and weighty, and it has a semi-long and silky soft coat. American breeder and baker developed ragdolls in the 1960s. They are best known for their docile, placid temperament and affectionate nature. The name ragdoll is derived from the tendency of individuals from the original breeding stock to go limp and relaxed when picked up. The breed is particularly popular in both the United Kingdom and the United States. Ragdolls are often known as dog-like cats or puppy-like cats due to their tendency to follow people around, their receptiveness to handling, and their relative lack of aggression towards other pets. Ragdolls are distinguishable by the upside-down V-shaped markings on their foreheads, large round blue eyes, soft, thick coats, thick limbs, long tails, and soft bodies. Their color rings are commonly tricolor or bicolor. Number 3. The Maine Coon. The Maine Coon is a large domesticated cat breed. It is one of the oldest natural breeds in North America. The breed originated in the U.S. state of Maine, where it is the official state cat. The breed was popular in cat shows in the late 19th century, but its existence became threatened when long-haired breeds from overseas were introduced in the early 20th century. The Maine Coon has since made a comeback and is now the third most popular pedigreed cat breed in the world. The Maine Coon is a large and social cat, which could be the reason why it has a reputation of being referred to as the gentle giant. The Maine Coon is predominantly known for its size and dense coat of fur which helps the large feline to survive in the harsh climate of Maine, the state from which they originated. The Maine Coon is often cited as having dog-like characteristics. Due to the large size of this feline, professionals have noticed certain health problems arising in the breed, including feline hypertrophic cardiomyopathy and hip dysplasia. Number 4. Ragamuffin Cat once considered to be a type of ragdoll cat, the ragamuffin was designated a separate breed in, in 1994. The ragamuffin is a docile cat who is well known for slumping into the arms of its owner in search of love and attention. The breed will adore you, your children, other animals, and, in most cases, strangers. They are known to play fetch and respond to basic commands, traits which puts them in a category of dog-like cats known as puppy cats. Number 5. Scottish Fold The Scottish Fold is a breed of domestic cat with a natural dominant gene mutation that affects cartilage throughout the body, causing the ears to fold, bending forward and down towards the front of the head, which gives the cat what is often described as an owl-like appearance. Originally called lop-eared or lops after the lop-eared rabbit, Scottish Fold became the breed's name in 1966. Depending on registries, long-haired Scottish Folds are varyingly known as Highland Fold, Scottish Fold Longhair, Longhair Fold and Kuari. Number 6. Bengal Cat The Bengal is another wild-looking cat breed that should be thought of as lively and playful. The breed is loving with its owners and is regarded as a pleasant companion because of its love and propensity to play. The Bengal is a high-energy cat and needs a lot of attention to thrive. 
The Bengal cat is a domesticated cat breed created from a hybrid of the Asian leopard cat with domestic cats, especially the spotted Egyptian Mao. The breed name comes from the leopard cat's taxonomic name. Bengals have a wild appearance, their golden shimmer comes from their leopard cat ancestry, and their coats may show spots, rosettes, arrowhead markings, or marbling. They are an, an energetic breed that needs much exercise and play. Number 7. Russian Blue. The Russian Blue is a stocky, athletic cat with a silky coat and a kind demeanor. Russian Blues, as the name implies, have blue coats and are native to Russia. The breed is noted for being sweet and calm, yet it also enjoys playing. The Russian Blue, in particular, prefers being up high, so expect stealthy assaults from atop a cabinet or other high perch. The Russian Blue is a naturally occurring breed that may have originated in the port of Arkhangelsk in Russia. They are also sometimes called Archangel Blues, too, it is believed that sailors took them from the Archangel Isles to Great Britain and Northern Europe in the 1860s. The first reference to an Archangel cat appears in British print in 1862. The first recorded appearance of one in a show was in 1872 at the Crystal Palace in England as the Archangel Cat. However, Harrison were writing in 1895 reported that the early show cats under the Russian blue name were British bred grey tabbies, with separate grey cats arriving from Archangel in Britain in the 1800s with features consistent with the modern breed. The Russian Blue competed in a class including all other blue cats until 1912, when it was given its own class. The breed was developed mainly in England and Scandinavia until after World War II. Number 8. Siberian Cat The Siberian is a centuries-old natural variety of domestic cat in Russia and recently developed as a formal breed with standards promulgated the world over since the late 1980s. Siberians vary from medium to medium-large in size. The formal name of the breed is Siberian Forest Cat, but it is typically referred to as the Siberian or Siberian Cat. Another, another formal breed name is the Moscow Semi-Longhair. The cat is an ancient breed that is now believed to be ancestral to all modern long-haired cats. The cat has similarities with the Norwegian Forest Cat, to which it is likely closely related. It is a natural breed from Siberia and the national cat of Russia. While it began as a landrus, it is selectively bred and pedigreed today in at least seven major cat fancier and breeder organizations. The color point variant of the breed is called the Neva Masquerade by some registries. The Siberian is a long-haired cat bred to withstand the severe winter environment of Siberia. While the breed doesn't mind playing, it prefers to rest on your lap or curl up for a nap. These cats are quite attached to their owners so expect to have a fluffy shadow while you're in the house. Number 9. British Shorthair The British Shorthair is the pedigreed version of the traditional British domestic cat, with a distinctively stocky body, dense coat, and broad face. The most familiar color variant is the British Blue, with a solid gray-blue coat, orange eyes, and a medium-sized tail. The breed has also been developed in a wide range of other colors and patterns, including tabby and color point. It is one of the most ancient cat breeds known. In modern times, it remains the most popular pedigreed breed in its native country, as registered by the UK's Governing Council of the Cat Fancy, GCCF. A quarter of all kittens registered with the GCCF each year are British shorthairs, making the British the most popular pedigree cat in the UK. The Brit British shorthair cat is one of the oldest English cat breeds, it is gentle, calm, and quiet. Because of the gorgeous blue coat that some of these cats have, this breed is also known as the British Blue. The breed gets along well with children, other cats, dogs, and just much every other pet you have. They are well known for their patience and tolerance. Number 10. Simric. The Simric is a breed of domestic cat. Some cat registries consider the Simric simply a semi-long-haired variety of the Manx breed, rather than a separate breed. Except for the length of fur, in all other respects the two varieties are the same, and kittens of either sort may appear in the same litter. The name comes from Simru, the indigenous Welsh name of Wales, though the breed is not associated with Wales, and the name was possibly given as an attempt to provide a Celtic-sounding name for the breed. The breed's Manx bloodline originated in the Isle of Man, though Canada claims to have developed the long-haired variant.
The breed is called the longhair manx, or a similar name, by some registries. The simric is essentially a long-haired version of the manx cat, which is well recognized for having no tail. If you're considering a simric, be sure to find a reputable breeder as these cats can have genetic health issues that must be screened for. Number 11. American Bobtail. The American Bobtail is an uncommon breed of domestic cat which was developed in the late 1960s. It is most notable for its stubby bobbed tail about one-third to one-half the length of a normal cat's tail. This is the result of a cat body type genetic mutation affecting the tail development, similar to that of a Manx cat. 1. The breed is not related to the Japanese bobtail, despite the similar name and physical type. The breeding programs, programs are entirely unrelated, and the genetic mutation causing the bobbed tail are known to be different because the mutation causing the American bobtail's tail is dominant, whereas the Japanese bobtail tail mutation is recessive. Number 12. British Long Hair. The British longhair is a longer-haired development from the long-standing British shorthair breed. In the mid-20th century, British shorthairs were interbred with imported long-haired varieties, like the Turkish Angora and what today is called the traditional Persian, with an aim to producing more stout and round-faced stock, while retaining the short coat. As a result of this hybridization, British catterers have frequently produced, generally unwanted, semi-long-haired offspring among their litters. In more recent years, these have been intentionally bred, often outside the UK, to each other and sometimes to standard British shorthairs, to establish a consistent, formalized British longhair bee. The Persian and the British shorthair were crossed to create the British longhair. The kitten that results is amiable and will be a lovely and loving companion. Because of their lush hair and lap-loving personality, they are frequently referred to as the teddy bear of feline breeds. Number Number 13. Burman. The Burman, also called the sacred cat of Burma, is a domestic cat breed. The Burman is a long-haired, color-pointed cat distinguished by a silky coat, deep blue eyes, and contrasting white gloves on each paw. The breed name is derived from Burmany, the French form of Burma. The Burman breed was first recognized in France by the Cat Club de France in 1925, then in England by the Governing Council of the Cat Fancy in 1966 and in United States by the Cat Fanciers Association in 1967. It is also recognized by the Canadian Cat Association and the International Cat Association. Burman cats have a pointed coat that comes in six various hues, but they nearly always have white socks and stunning blue eyes. They have long, lovely coats and a cheerful demeanor. The Burman is a kind cat who will discreetly remind you to feed it while providing affection to you and the rest of your family. Number 14. Egyptian Mao. Egyptian Maus are a small to medium-sized short-haired cat breed. They are one of the few naturally spotted breeds of domesticated cat. The spots of the Mao occur on only the tips of the hairs of its coat. It is considered a rare breed. The Egyptian Mao is a breed of cat that may or may not be derived from the original Egyptian cat, although no one knows for sure. These cats are frequent vocalizers so be prepared for a chatty cat. The species enjoys hunting but is as content at home with its family, which can include people of all ages as well as other cats and canines. Number 15. Persian. The Persian cat, also known as the Persian longhair, is a long-haired breed of cat characterized by a round face and short muzzle. The first documented ancestors of Persian cats were imported into Italy from Persia around 1620. Widely recognized by cat fancy since the late 19th century, Persian cats were first adopted by the British and later by American breeders after World War II. Some cat fancier organizations breed standards subsume the Himalayan and exotic shorthair as variants of this breed, while others generally treat them as separate breeds. The selective breeding carried out by breeders has allowed the development of a wide variety of coat colors, but has also led to the creation of increasingly flat-faced Persian cats. Favored by fanciers, this head structure can bring with it a number of health problems. As is the case with the Siamese breed, there have been efforts by some breeders to preserve the older type of cat, the traditional breed, having a more pronounced muzzle, which is more popular with the general public. Hereditary polycystic kidney disease is prevalent in the breed, affecting almost half of the population in some countries. 
This lovely cat breed has grown to be one of the most popular in North America. The Persian breed's history is unknown, however, they are assumed to have originated in Persia in the 1600s. They may be loving and lovely, but owners should be aware that they shed a lot and require care. That's all for today. See you in another video. If you enjoy the video and found it informative then please like the video and let us know your opinion in the comment box. Never forget to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon next to it. Share the video if we earn it. Thanks for watching.